in Tempe, Arizona, the Phoenix Cardinals and the Pittsburgh Steelers. And when there's cacti, it can only be 120 degrees and extremely hot in Tempe. Steelers, only shining moment. Rod Woodson, sprinter speed, 92 yards. As no one will catch him on this play. He takes it down the sidelines and into the end zone, but that was just about all the celebrating the Steelers would do today. Phoenix air attack wins the game. Lomax, the tight end, Rob Awal over the middle, 32 yards. NFC Rookie of the Year out last year. Had an ankle injury, looks like he's back. Roy Green enters the game averaging over 18 yards a catch. This one from Lomax, 37 yards. Green only had four catches on the day, but take a look at how far they were for 119 yards. When he makes a catch, it's for a long ball. Lomax spread the wealth around. Looking for Jay Novacek along the sidelines. 26 yards on this one as he's wide open as well. Came in leading all tight ends in the NFC and catches in both yardage. Chuck Knoll's defense looks porous. The, the steel curtain looks like steel wool lately. And Neil Lomax played well. Came in as a third-rated quarterback in the NFC and just gets it done again with almost 300 yards. Of course, J.T. Smith made his presence felt as well. J.T. Smith over the middle, spins and takes it into the end zone. He also with a big day, two touchdowns. Gene Stallings, Cardinals, have won their fourth straight game, and they're looking promising in Phoenix. What a move this has been. Cardinals last won four in a row in 1984. Todd Blackledge was not the answer for the Pittsburgh Steelers. The Steelers, Chris, after winning their first game of the season against the Cowboys, they haven't tasted victory since.